say to you guys, and to believe it or not, I got inspiration from Mulan. Don't judge me. Don't judge me, y'all. I, I, got, I got inspiration from the Disney movie, Mulan. I was watching the movie and then all of a sudden my shoulders start going because you know my song came on. Let's get down to business. Uh, <laughs> What's the next lyric? <laughs> oh, you guys know. Okay, okay. All right, we got we got some Disney fans in here. If you don't know Disney, then uh, unfortunately you're missing out. You are missing out. I think his name is Sun Yu. He ends up getting to the emperor. He draws his sword and puts it up to the emperor's head and says, bow to me. And the emperor did not flinch. He just looks over and he says these words. He said, no matter how strong the wind howls, the mountain cannot bow to it. And when he said that, I don't know what it was, but I just thought about you guys. I'm like, that's it. That's what I'm going to talk to them about. No matter how strong the wind howls, the, the mountain cannot bow to it. Now, I am constructed out of unbreakable material. And each one of you that are sitting on this, class, uh, on, on this on this call right now, you have to understand you're in 11th grade and 12th grade because each one of you are made of unbreakable material. Yes, things aren't going as they should. They're not going as planned. It seems like that the world is falling apart, but even with everything falling apart, you are still standing. You are still pushing forward. You are still getting your homework assignments done. You are still getting up when the teacher is not telling you to get up. You're still doing everything that you need to do. Why? Because you're made of unbreakable material. No matter how the wind howls, the mountain cannot bow to it. You may say to me,